What's up, Flash Rock? This is TFG coming at you once again. Tonight, we have some musicians of a true Ovidian nature. This is Ovid.
giants together we attack the giants With the leaders and the lions together we attack the giants Thanks guys, uh, this is going to be our last song, it's called March of the Funeral uh, You guys can check us out on uh, myspace.com slash Ovid uh, Once again we're Ovid, thank you Ovid do uh, their set here at flashrock.com. 
Uh, gentlemen, introduce yourselves, and again, for the blind, state what you do in the band. I am uh, Christopher Lance Coronado. I go by Lance. I am a lead guitarist slash backup vocals in the band. Uh, my name is Andrew Coronado. I do uh, drums and uh, backup vocals also. Andrew Garcia and lead vocal and rhythm guitar. Uh, Edwin Espideros, or everybody calls me Junior. Uh, I play the bass. Nice. All right, so your guy's name is Ovid, all right, but um, I'm not sure everybody out there is aware. It's taken from a different uh, meaning, so to speak. Uh, you guys want to elaborate on that, kind of give the, uh, the background on the name of the band? Yeah, um, Ovid is uh, short for Ovidius. He was a poet, and um, I, uh, I worked with a guy back uh, a couple years ago, and we hadn't had a name for a band yet, and he gave me the book, Ovid, Poets in Exile, we read it and we uh, we liked a couple of the poems and actually our first one of our first songs we wrote was Poets in Exile and uh, that's where we, we, we started from and it's just Ovid now and nice yeah nice, nice catchy little phrase there Poets in Exile it's, that's <laughs> the way most musicians I think feel in general just being a musician well you guys have got a cool sound going on obviously there's a little bit deeper meaning going on with the band I would assume being the name you chose uh, what, what is it that uh, got you guys uh, started? What is it that really influenced you guys to like pick up the mantle of, of musicians? Um, well, okay, Lance is my brother, and uh, like we kind of, we kind of just pick. We're picking up instruments like at you know at home and stuff, and like you know we kind of jam out all the time, and then we try to start this band thing, and then uh, and then Andrew is uh, Lance's friend from high school. Didn't know. A thing about guitar or a thing about singing. He didn't even know he could sing, but he just wanted to be in a band, and so we just started jamming. Nice. Yeah, and Junior was always really good at the bass, <clears throat> and so um, we just kind of jammed out for a while, and then Andrew found out he could sing really good, and so that's and so we just started you know jamming, and then we were like, hey, we got a band. Pieces just kind of fell in place, mm -hmm. and before yeah. you know it, you guys are doing it. Yeah, very cool. Well, you got a pretty good uh, disc here. Is this the only uh, CD you guys have got out right now, or do you yeah, other stuff? Yeah, that one we just got pressed uh, not too long ago, and so um, it's pretty new. Um, yeah, that's all we have out right now. Very cool. Uh, you have anything in the works for new stuff, or kind of just promoting this right now? Yeah, we have like three new songs that aren't on the CD that are new, and we're going to put on the next album, and uh, they're really good ones. They better be. Yeah. <laughs> if you're gonna back them, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're just, we're really writing like yeah. a whole new, you know, whole new stuff and yeah, stuff like we're that. We're trying to grow up in our music and mm -hmm. everything. Well, know? let me ask you about that. How how is it? What, what's the writing like uh, with this band? I mean, do you all kind of come to the table with something, or does somebody come with a song? How's that working for you guys? Um, well, a, a lot of the times, uh, me or Andrew will mess with the riff. I'll have a riff, and then we'll just work all around that riff and just put the chords that go with it put you know the sequence put just all that and a lot of times when I I, I bring a whole song to the table it, it doesn't really stick just because that's how I would make it and that's not how we would make it you know right, so right. and then uh, from there we we uh, we just get the music first and then the lyrics kind of <clears> just come we whatever mood we're in it, it tends to help us write a lot deeper write a lot more to where you can feel it you know when and instead of just putting words to a song. You know? So you guys kind of jam out something for a while until yeah. you feel it's kind of yeah, ready yeah, and then you yeah, exactly. put, the, uh, yeah, put the lyrics to it. Very cool. Yeah, yeah it's, it's, uh, it's good to see bands actually kind of getting in there and experimenting as opposed to trying to kick out those cookie cutter songs, yeah. you know. So yeah. <laughs> very cool. Well, gentlemen, here's the point where usually they're like scratching their head. They don't know what to say. A lot of the bands are usually drunk. That's why. So... <laughs> But uh, now's your moment to say whatever's on your mind. Say hi to mom, dad, girlfriends, whatever, you know. Speak to the world because they're watching. Uh, pretty much, we just like to thank everybody, everybody that comes to watch us. <coughs> We're so appreciative of everybody who enjoys our music or is just a really good friend and comes out. Um, we love you guys all. Same thing, I'd like to thank all, like, everyone who's stuck with us through our music. Like, my parents, my, these are my, like, my family right here. And my girlfriend helps me a lot. And um, just to all the fans who like know what's up with us, know what we're about, and like listen to us more than just listening to music. They're listening with their heart and everything, like you know. 
thanks to everyone. Uh, I'd like to thank um, all our friends, especially because uh, they helped us get out there. Like in the beginning, they're like our fans are like so loyal. Thank you for coming to all the shows and to everybody who is a new fan. Um, we hope you guys find our music very inspiring. Hope you guys like the lyrics because they really mean something. They're not just something that you know. They're not about a day in our lives. They're about life. I just want to thank God for keeping us together for more than just the band. We've been really good friends for a long time, and I just want to say thanks for that. And to all the fans. <laughs> we love every one of you. These guys sound like a really grateful band. Real quick before uh, you guys get out of here, <coughs> any f new fans or the old ones that don't know where to get a hold of you, how do they find you? Where can they, do you have a website, MySpace? What's going on with that? Yeah, uh, we got MySpace.com slash Ovid. It's uh, O-V-I-D. Um, yeah, you'll find us on there. Uh, you'll be able to purchase the CD on the on the MySpace also. Um, hope you guys hope we'll every, cool yeah, T-shirts, T-shirts, merch. You could probably you could buy on the MySpace sure. also. And so um, everyone in Southern California, hope you guys can catch our shows. Yeah, leave us a comment. Tell us you saw us on wherever a show. Tell us you want on us the to internet, come out somewhere. Flash Rock. Nice. Flash Rock. Thank you, Flash Rock, so much. Thank yeah, you thanks guys, guys so for coming much. in. We're glad to get you in here. It was, a, it was a little bit of work, but we got it done. Yeah. yeah. So, this is a good disc here. You heard a couple, all the songs were uh, tonight were from this disc, right? Um, two of them were. Two of them were? Yeah, one of them was a brand new one. It's not recorded yet. All right. Well, on this disc, you got nine songs, so it's not like some little EP or anything like that. You're going to get a full-length disc with this. And if you like what you heard, hit them up uh, where they told you to, and you can get your copy. Uh, again, I want to thank Ovid for coming in here, <laughs> all right, and uh, laying, laying down some true old school poetic type verses and lines on us. Uh, gentlemen, thank you very much for coming in. Thank you. Thank you. And bands out there, if you want to try to do this too, just hit up the, the flashrock.com, check it out. we got all the information about how to get your uh, band songs on our radio show and perform a Flash Rock Live. So once again, I'm TFG, this is Ovid, this was Flash Rock Live, tune in for the next one. You guys rocked it. Great job, man. Thanks. Real professionals. Yes. Oh, you guys took it. You know what he Thanks said that freaked me out? He said, and my girlfriend helps. Oh. My girlfriend just took it over. I was like, she helps me. 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 She helps I'm gonna get it because I can't write after you. It's kind of a special. It took me to another realm. It wasn't here. It wasn't on this earth. I went somewhere else. And it was just total.